Good morning, family. <coughs> it is Monday, and I am headed in for this CT scan. See, we're headed up to the hospital now. I'm supposed, supposed to be there. Oh, my hair looks crazy and blue. I didn't put no wig on, family, because you know they're gonna make me. Um, they're gonna make me. Uh, they're gonna make me take my um, wig off. So I didn't even put it on, family. So, what you're seeing is all me, all me. So, I'm about to walk into here and um, get this done. Like I said, it is a little bit, almost 10:30. My um, time to have this um, CT scan is. 11 but they wanted me to be here at 10 45 so and let me tell you family um it is chilly it is really chilly today they said it's only gonna be uh 52 degrees and everything over the weekend it was kind of nice and this, the rest of the week it's supposed to be in the 70s and 80s the boys graduate wednesday and it's supposed to be 75 so this right here this one right here can make you sick seriously you know, going through the whole house. I'm the only one who ain't had nothing yet. So let's hope I don't get nothing either. So we're going in now, family. Hopefully they won't have me waiting long. Whew. Thank you. I'm about to go register and I'll be back. Okay, fine. I'm sitting in registration waiting to um, be called back. So, my face looks greasy. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. You know, head. Mm. Well, yeah, like I said, fine. That's what I'm going to do. Wait for me to get um, called back for registration. I did blow up the last time. So, you know, it's all about. Uh, Getting a CT scan and finding out the results. So, you know. It's not too problem here. You know, so, hopefully, this one not take long. Oh, that husband. Now you won't put me on camera, huh? No, <laughs> come here, come here. Come here. Hey, family, how you going? Oh, you're not nervous, are you, baby? I just, I don't uh, be over with. Okay, you know I think she, I think she's more um, urgent to get it over with than, than, than anything. Am I correct? Mm -hmm. Okay, tell the camera. Say yes, I am. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah, so what we gonna do? Um, you know, hopefully, you know, I mean, it's lightweight crowded. It's not like real crowded, but hopefully they'll, they'll push her through and get her out. So we can get her to get her some lunch. You know, because uh, yeah, am I correct? Yeah, I'm hungry. Okay. Yeah, I mean, hope you hope you guys have a blessed day. Um, you know, uh, this is one of the days you know where you know you have to take care of business, and especially when it comes down to your medical or something going on medically with you. Um, that comes first and foremost over everything. Cause nothing happens if you if you don't get a clear medical pass. And you, you and I both know that. You know, and that's how, that's where I stand on that in every, in every way with every member of my family. And I know you feel the same way. That's true. So. You know, um, this morning I couldn't even drink nothing or nothing because even though I couldn't drink, you know, my appointment's at um, 11, but when I had the weight loss surgery, you know, my stomach changed where, you know, it takes forever for anything, any liquid or food to go into my, to digest in my stomach. So I knew probably that by the time it was time for this um, CT scan and I had to lay down, the food wouldn't have been digested. So you know, that's why I didn't even eat nothing. And so the girl is starving. You know, so hopefully that like husband said and I said mm -hmm. that we can get this done over with because um, I am starving and I am thirsty. So family, when I, they call me back, I'll put the camera back on. Okay, family? I'll be back. Okay. For Monday, right? Yeah, for Monday. We're going back, family. As you can see, hugging with me. So we're going back. This is a pretty easy test for you. It's only about seven minutes long, and then you'll be done. Oh, that, that's good. Seven yeah. minutes. Yep, that's not bad. Don't work for me. Work for me. Okay, family. All right, family. We are back here in another part waiting room. You know, 
they say seven minutes so let's see how true that is so they brought me back here and um they say they be coming to get me so we're gonna see how I'm, look at him seven minutes seven minutes i see i see see how i worked out family she she thought it was gonna be a long test she thought it was, she thought it was gonna be about 30 35 minutes to an hour and uh it's only seven minutes you know, see it all worked out here you know we don't have to wait you know, spend a whole lot a whole lot of time in the hospital she doesn't have to take an extended long test so how do you feel about that mm -hmm. i hope that they they stay true to their word and it be seven minutes it could be seven minutes you know no, that's, that's good. Seven yeah, minutes yeah. worth for me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, that's where we at now. They're going to come and get me in a minute. So, I'm going to let you know. Update. You see, I got my arm. I can't see. Can't see? She got, she got, a, famous, she got a famous wristband. <laughs> okay. Yep. She, um, her family to pray for her. It's, all, it's going to be all good. It's all God. Amen to that. So after this test and everything, we just gotta wait for the results. I think my um doctor said they get it in like a week, and then um once I find some out, I'll let you guys know. Okay. So I'll be back, family, after the test is over. With. Okay, family, we are leaving. I am done. Didn't take long at all. So we are leaving. The technician said that radiology will get the results and then it'll be sent to my doctor and then i'll get the results so that part of that testing is over with and uh now we gotta wait to um get the results so hopefully i'll have them by the end of um uh this week if she said not by this week definitely i'll have it um by monday so that's what we are waiting for the results for the CT scan family so we can figure out uh, why I keep having headaches and why when I do have the headaches um husband said I get lumps in the back of the head Ain't that what you say yeah that is correct yeah when she um when she gets stressed out or you know or, or she catches a headache back of her head does expand and one day I was basically um, hugging my wife I happened to you know you know, feel the back of her head. I was actually giving her a head massage, and and I felt this lump in the back of her head. I said, "Wait a minute!" I said, "Hold on, sweetheart." I said, "I said this doesn't sound normal. This sounds abnormal." And she was like, "What are you talking about?" I said, "No, I said I don't like it." And immediately, we set up a doctor's appointment, and this is where we. This is the sole purpose that as we're here today to get um, to get you know, you know, the results of why she was getting these lumps in the back of her head. You know, like I, I've probably heard me say this before. In the previous vlogs, when you see something, you got to react right away, especially medical-wise. You know, I mean, things have been gone, um, un, un, you know, undetermined and you know, undiagnosed for so long for so many people. I mean, including myself. You know, I can use myself as an example. So that's why we you know, especially concerning your loved one, I mean, something you see, you see if it's abnormal, like I did with my wife, for instance, today, and. You know, you, you have to do something about it. You know, say, hey, you know, I noticed this is about you. And, I, and I've been with my wife for 22 years now, you know. So, you know, so uh, I would know if I've seen a difference amongst her. She would know the same for me. Would, would I correct or not? Mm -hmm. Okay. So that so it's like, it, it's basically like that. We, you know, we, we pray that that is nothing. And if it's nothing, then it's, then it's God's will. Mm -hmm. and, and that's what we, we, we're going to go by God's will. Okay, family? Exactly. We're definitely going to go by God's will, you know. Anything that um, we go through, you go through, make sure you leave it in God's hands. Always leave it in His hands because, you know, I know that He's a miracle worker in everything. So, family, we are about to get out of here. I'm finally going to be able to give me something to drink, family, because I'm starving and I am thirsty. So, um, I'll be vlogging again um wednesday because the boys like i was telling you guys they graduate from eighth grade yes they graduate from eighth grade you know um it's a lot of things that's been going on <laughs> you know what i mean we got them graduating from eighth grade and guess who's gonna be a pappy uh -oh. <laughs> i'm gonna be a pappy i'm going to be a grandfather my, my oldest son is having a son isn't that something right <laughs> so yeah, so I'm gonna be a, I'm gonna be a grandfather. I found 
that out some days ago. Um, you know, good news. I uh, told congratulations. It's a, you know, it's a new bark in life for yourself. But, and I guess, the, you know, I also told him, I said, well, I, I guess the shoemaker name lives on. I guess it does. <laughs> the legacy lives, right? Mm hmm <laughs> family um like i said i'll be vlogging um wednesday because the boys graduate so until the next vlog family love you love you love you talk to you soon